afternoon, everybody. Uh, what's going on, guys? A little more of the Division 2. We are going to roam around the Judiciary Square area, which I kind of I kind of wandered in there early in the game, and uh, I was probably level 1 or 2, and it was just like one shot kill done. So I looked at the map, and I was like, oh, this is a level 25 area to level 30, so that's why I'm getting one shot killed in here. So now I'm level 30, just uh, doing some of the, you know, just roaming around, getting the shade, uh, cash it, uh, shade, briefcases, whatever, all that stuff, and uh, just uh, taking over some of these control points, and, uh, you know, maybe we'll get a mission in here and there, but uh, it's Division 2, man, this is a huge game, and it's a fun game, and I am not bored of it yet, um, which is awesome. I mean, I gotta be honest with you, I have played huge open world games where I am bored of it before I complete it. Games that are actually pretty good games. Games that are well-regarded games. Um, but I'm not bored of this one yet, so that's cool. You know? Let's see what we got here. That motherfucker. All right, cool. Man, you can't see shit sometimes with this weather system in this game. So we got a little haze right now. Uh, I'm guessing it's it's. I haven't figured out if there's a way to check the in-game time, but from the looks of this, I would guess this is early morning. But or or maybe maybe late, maybe like uh, you know sunset, twilight time. So these guys are fucking ridiculous. Loaded. That'll help. Yeah. There we go. That turret never fails me, dude. Love that turret. Love that turret. That is by far my favorite little, uh, favorite skill in this game, the turret. And, and to be fair, the uh, the chemical launcher too, because it's, it's just a way to replenish your health. Alright, let's see. What, what, what did this guy drop? What did this guy drop? Yeah, they're not going to do nothing for me. Um, yeah. They're not going to do nothing for me. That's okay. I'm pretty high level now, so... You know, you're not going to pick up too much stuff that you're going to be like, holy shit. And I'm just free roaming. Just kind of blindly roaming around here, seeing what I could pick up. Uh, I, I, I did get enough carbon fiber yesterday to craft um, that one weapon I really like. What's that thing called? Hold on. The, uh, this one here. The Police M4 Replica. So I got a high-end one now. 3.6 damage, 850 rounds per minute. Put the extended uh, mag on it, as you can see here. Um, 10 extra bullets, got the hand stop. I could have went with the handle to give a little more accuracy, but this, this speeds up your reload speed, which is, you know, that's kind of important too. So yeah, this gun's a beast. Um, I've been using this gun since I was, like, level probably, damn, four or five. Just every level, just craft a new one. Um, that's kind of a cool thing about this game that I like. You know, I remember crafting in the Division 1, but I don't remember crafting nearly as much stuff um, as I have in this game. Maybe I'm wrong. Maybe I just didn't get into the crafting portion of the Division 1, but I, I really feel like crafting wasn't as big of a part of that game as it is in this game. I think I already, I think I kind of explored over here yesterday. Now, let me take a look on this map. Let's head over here. Let's go take these fuckers out over here. All right. 
Dude, I just love exploring all like the underground areas in this game too. Those are fucking cool. I love exploring open world games. Wait, shit. I've been into exploring open world games since the original Zelda came out in 80. I guess I got it maybe in 80. 87 maybe? I don't know. I was I was little. I was I was like six or seven. Maybe it was a little later than that. Um, I think that game came out in 86. But uh, yeah, I got a Nintendo on Christmas. And I think it was 86 into 87. And uh, oh shit. Me and my brother were playing that thing, man. We were loving it. Still love those old Zelda games. Man, I must have put I must have put 500 hours into Breath of the Wild. That shit was awesome. Love that game. I re you know I've heard that Nintendo's working on a sequel, um, a Zelda sequel. Um, I know they announced the remake of Link's Awakening. I know that, but they are there's also rumors that they're working on a different game. And some people think it could be a sequel to Breath of the Wild. That would be fucking amazing. Would love to see a sequel to that game. Come on, dude. Stand up. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. Man, I hate those things, dude. Let's see fucking cap this guy. There we go. Two more times, I think we'll have him. Yeah. Damn, dude, he's making another fucking little remote control fucking bomb on wheels, dude. Get out the fucking fully automatic. One more, one more. Where is he? Let's get this dude with the fucking sniper rifle. If I can find him. Oh, maybe he's dead. Well, whatever the case may be, he somehow disappeared, so. All right, let's see what we got in here. Let's see, let's see. I need that carbon fiber, man. That shit is scarce in this game, dude. Maybe I'm just not looking in the right spots. I don't know, but shit, I've been playing the game for a while now. You think I would know how to find a fucking carbon fiber? This is ridiculous. Which way am I going? Dude, I was a good two to three weeks in before I realized you could sell all that little bullshit that you find, like notebooks and kids toy and sell whatever you find. I didn't know you could sell that until I was two or three weeks in, so. Uh, you don't get a lot of money for it, but <laughs> Shit was just building up like there's no tomorrow in my inventory. I had no idea. No idea. Oh, territory control. They usually got some good, um... They usually got some good fucking toys and trinkets here. Just make sure my stream is working correctly. Alright. Looks that way. Looks that way. Let's go take these guys out over here. Oh yeah, look at him. He's not even looking, dude. If I bust a cap in his head, he's done. Oh, wow. Ah, 
Ah, oh, shit! I'm gonna die. Fuck! 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 Crazy bitch, man. I got too close. Fuck! Oh, Jesus. Get down, dude. Get down. Woo! That was fucking close, man. Oh, yeah, things in a decent spot. It is. It is! Yes! Ah, yeah, dude. I mean, this big dumb smile on my face that I survived that shit. Come on, shoot him. I think I can safely go in here now. Oh my god, look at the damage on that thing. The problem is, is that you can only put two bullets in it. And, um... You can only put two bullets in that fucking thing. And the accuracy is terrible, so if you miss... Electronic device detected. <laughs> Capri pants, sweet. Nothing says um, badass uh, mercenary more than Capri Pants, man. Well, I guess if you're playing with a female character, I think uh, Capri Pants are favored more by women, but I could be wrong on that. I guess anybody can wear some Capris, right? I guess the goal is just, you know, to make them cool. I think that I'm going to start doing that. I'm going to get myself some Capri Pants. Deconstruct. I just want to deconstruct that one item. Whatever, we'll uh, we'll figure it out when we get back to the base. All right, maybe there's something up here for us to find. Oh, cool. See what's up here. Guess that's nothing. There's some shit. Oh. Wasn't much higher. More level. What's this? Take a look at that bad boy. Damn. Mmm, nah, I don't think it's worth it. Yeah, you lose a lot more in health than you gain in armor.
right, dude. That's a. Oh, I think that's a electronic. I think that's a phone right there. Why can't I grab that shit? Oh, maybe I'm not on that shit. No, I was. Huh. I wonder if that's some kind of glitch that I can't grab that shit. Because that's. There's supposed to be some sort of message there. Eh. Yeah. Huh. That's weird. here it looked like there was an area we could climb down here oh but you know what maybe there's some shit on these steps here and I don't want to climb down there and then not be able to get back up to check these steps no nah, maybe not oh there's something down there though all right we can get back over here let's uh let's go check this shit out over here Steel. Oh, you know what? Let's uh share this with somebody. Escape this bad boy. Man, where is that carbon fiber that I need so badly to build anything cool? There we go. Oh, what's that? That's an SASG 12. Let's see what kind of power this thing has. Cause I, what's that? All right, that's a covert SRS. This thing, I mean, you could pop off more rounds with this, but this thing's got way more power, dude. Holy shit. That thing's got to be a one-shot kill on most enemies up close. But, you know, the damage tapers off with distance. So if you hit a dude with that gun from like, you know, 20 feet away, you're going to get the whole damage. But if you're 80 feet away, it's going to lose something. Which makes sense. Listen, the only thing in the division that really doesn't make sense is, uh, is how you need to put 600 bullets in a guy to drop, you know, knock him down. Oh, oh that's one of my people there. Fuck you. Yeah, it's over for you. What are these cats? Fucking my guy up here. Got him. Got him. 